A Dagon community in Ogoja local government area of Cross River State is asking the federal government to fulfill its promises to upgrade primary health care facilities across the country. The members of the community say it's evident that government is not matching words with action as the only community health center in the area, which has been struggling to function for about a decade, was put up by communal efforts. We just manage this for ourselves. Because we know that if we have a health center or a health post nearer to us, uh, most of the health problems we have can be solved here in the house. So that's why we say we must run it. Whether it costs anything, we must run it. And all, all the, everything local government came and promised us they would do, they had not done anything. More worrisome is that the facility is also expected to serve Cameroonian refugees who are camped a few miles away from the community. The government should assist us to bring more facilities to develop the, the, the same institution. A closer look exposes the conditions inside the health center where women are forced to have their babies on a wooden bed. If they want to give birth, most of them, like the refugees, they are giving complaint that the table is very hard for them to climb. And they want, if they want to climb, no way for them to keep their legs and climb. And when we want to take care of them when delivering, they used to suffer it. And it's making them not to be coming here regularly again. The Cross River State Government is also appealing to the federal government to release the basic funds budgeted to revitalize the health centers. It's been a lip service to health care in Nigeria and I think it's time for us to change things. I think it's time for us to do the right things at the right time. They should put their money where their mouth is. As a country, we should put more into health care and not just in Abuja, but let it trickle, go all the way down to the villages, to the rural areas. And that's one of the things which basic health care was supposed to do. With the influx of the Cameroonian refugees into communities such as Ogoja, any basic facilities will expectedly be overstretched, but the community hopes that their presence will show there's a pressing health need and spur the government to action to build a better facility.